News 5's Meg Shaw shares their story. About a year ago, a couple here in Northeast Ohio was ecstatic. They just found out they were pregnant, expecting a baby girl. It was a relatively normal pregnancy. I felt pretty good. But that normalcy faded at week 36. During the ultrasound, um, I could tell that the tech saw something. Jen Bohach says she went in for what she thought would be a normal ultrasound, but it wasn't. You know, I could just feel like my heart dropping a little bit. Her husband Patrick says Jen could barely get the words out. There was something wrong with their baby. It was it was very scary. They discovered it was congenital diaphragmatic hernia, also known as CDH, a rare birth defect, meaning there's a hole in the baby's diaphragm, causing intestines like the stomach, liver, and colon to move up into the chest. I had just never heard of it. Jen and Patrick were fearing the worst because only about 1,600 children are born with CDH each year, and at least 30% of babies die from the condition. So after getting the emotional news, the Bohatch family went to Dr. Daryl Cass at the Cleveland Clinic for answers, who looked at the ultrasound and MRI and said, things will be okay. So we were very optimistic. That Cass and another surgeon at the clinic formed a treatment plan, and just four days after baby Natalie was born, they operated on her small body. We put a camera inside, we put instruments inside. We were able to push the intestines, the stomach, the colon, uh, some of the liver, the spleen, back into the abdominal cavity. Natalie then spent three weeks at the hospital recovering. Dr. Cass says she is doing better than 90% of babies in her position. And I expect her to have a great, normal life forever. Natalie is now five months old. Called miracle baby all the time. Yeah. And spends her days at home clinging to mom and dad, smiling from ear to ear. Jen says while she's more grateful than words can say, she tries not to think about what Natalie went through. I'm so grateful for the clinic and, you know, that she turned out the way she did, but... It's not something I dwell on. I, I don't really think about it much. And I just, I'm so happy that she's doing as well as she is. And I just, I do think that we're incredibly lucky. In Cleveland, Meg Shaw, News 5. Uh, Danita said it. Cute kid, right? Cute kid.